Hello everyone, today I just wanted to show you an update I've made for the script Crosshair. I've basically made it into a complete guides control panel now. So Crosshair now looks like this, where you've got five buttons instead of just the original Crosshair button. I've also fixed a bug with parenting, so if layers are parented now and you click Crosshair, it does go in the actual location, whereas before the parenting would mess it up and it would chuck your guide somewhere random in the composition which wasn't ideal so now you can select layers that are parented to other layers drop in a guide and it goes in the right place which is good the second button is remove all guides so like so I just demonstrated that so if you had for example here and I'd finished rigging up all the the, um, the limbs with these red circles and then I wanted to do the, the, the green ones next I can just remove the guides and then I can do the green versions so that's quite handy the next feature is snap so when you click this this will turn snap to guides on or off uh, this is useful when you're using the anchor point position tool and if you want to snap it here currently it's snapping but if that was off it kind of it's not very accurate so it's nice to just quickly be able to turn that on and off uh, the next feature is lock and this will with the V tool the arrow tool if it's unlocked it will let you move the guides about if it's locked you can't so that's quite nice again Oh. and finally we just got view guide visibility I keep hitting enter when you click this one just turns the guides on and off that's pretty much it for the interface um, I'm just gonna quickly show you now how to install it with using kbar um, if I just open up kbar So, first thing you want to do is click this gear icon for the settings and then click add button and then we're going to go to run JSX and you need to browse the file. So I'm just going to find the... So here's the JSX file. If I open that and then what you need to do here, because there's five buttons and not one, you need to define using a script function or argument which of these buttons you want to to build so if I type in crosshair that's the the script function argument for this button here and I'll just call this crosshair as well if you go to icon you can then select um, PNG or SVG and then if you click browse I will be giving away all the icons with the, the, the download as well so you can select the icon click open and click OK OK and then when you close this you have a new button now so if I select a few layers and click crosshair I had the guides turned off let's just do that again click crosshair it now does it the same as how it does here and that's a K bar button so if you wanted to add the other ones you do the same again add button run JSX file let's go to crosshair again and this one I will type in oh, remove guides like so again come and find the icon oh that's the wrong one okay so now I've got this button here which removes the guides I'm just going to quickly show you what happens if you type in the functionality wrong so here if I typed in remove guide instead of guides 
it comes up with a script alert which is an error and here it gives you the list of all the functions so if you need to find out what they're actually called so this one's called guide snap guide lock and guide visibility I will attach a text document as well so you can just copy and paste these if that's easier but yeah if they don't work that would be the reason why so you just need to come in here and make sure it's spelled correctly like so and now that works nicely so yeah that's it for the script it's just a nice little panel now to control anything to do with guides I hope you find this useful and I will see you soon.